Hey everyone, I'm Vivek Yadav from Aspire Hosting and today I'm going to show you exactly how to disable both end and the nether on your Minecraft server. Whether you want to keep your players in the overworld or just make things a bit simpler, this guide is super easy, let's jump right in. First, you need to get into your server files. If you are using Aspire Hosting, it's super simple. Just head into your control panel and open the file manager. Here you can see I'm opening file manager and you have to look for a file called server.properties. This file is basically controls a lot of server settings. So you have to find allow dash nether. So it will be true. You need to make it false. So make it false. Make sure to not make any mistakes here because it will crack the server files after making it false. You just have to save the server files. Go to console and restart your server. Now let's try to go into the nether. And you can see I am not able to get into the nether. That's it, the nether is now disabled. Your players won't be able to go there anymore. Now let's disable the end. Head on to your server files and go to bucket.yml. Here you will see allow dash and pretty much same as the nether. You have to make it false, so select the true and make it false. Scroll down and save the content. After saving the content, you just have to go to console and restart your server. Okay, now let's try to get into the end dimension. And here you can see I'm not able to go into that. So yeah. That's how you can disable end and the nether on your Minecraft server. If this video helped you out, drop a like and subscribe, it really support the channel. And if you are looking for fast, reliable and super easy Minecraft server hosting, definitely check our Aspire hosting. I'll leave a link in the description below. Thanks for watching, I'll see you in the next video.